Translation. Let us discuss the following question. The question says evaluate integral of 1 by 5 plus 4 cos x from 0 to pi. Let's now begin with the solution. Let i is equal to integral of 1 by 5 plus 4 cos x from 0 to pi. We know that cos x is equal to 1 minus tan square x by 2 divided by 1 plus tan square x by 2. By using this formula, we can write i as integral of 1 by 5 plus 4 into 1 minus tan square x by 2 divided by 1 plus tan square x by 2 from 0 to pi. Now this is equal to integral of 1 plus tan square x by 2 divided by 5 plus 5 tan square x by 2 plus 4 minus 4 tan square x by 2 from 0 to pi. Now this is equal to integral of 1 plus tan square x by 2 is secant square x by 2 as 1 plus tan square theta is equal to secant square theta. So by using this identity we have written 1 plus tan square x by 2 as secant square x by 2 divided by tan square x by 2 plus 9 lower limit is 0 and upper limit is pi. Now secant square x is the derivative of tan x so we are now going to put tan x by 2 as t. Differentiating both sides with respect to x we get dt by dx equals to secant square x by 2 into 1 by 2. This implies secant square x by 2 into dx is equal to 2 times dt. Now we will change the lower and upper limit. When x is equal to 0, then t is equal to tan 0 and tan 0 is 0. And when x is equal to pi, then t is equal to tan pi by 2 and tan pi by 2 is infinity. So by substituting t in place of tan x by 2, 2 times dt in place of secant square x by 2 into dx and by changing the lower and upper limit, we can write i as 2 into integral of 1 by t square plus 9 from 0 to infinity. Now this is equal to 2 into integral of 1 by t square plus 3 square from 0 to infinity. Now that integral of 1 by x square plus a square with respect to x is equal to 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus c. So, by using this, i is equal to 2 into, now here, 
in place of a we have 3 and in place of x we have t. So integral 1 by t square plus 3 square is equal to 1 by 3 tan inverse t by 3 lower limit is 0 and upper limit is infinity. Now this is equal to 2 into 1 by 3 tan inverse infinity by 3 minus 1 by 3 tan inverse 0 by 3 and this is equal to 2 by 3 tan inverse infinity by 3. Now tan inverse 0 by 3 is equal to 0. So we are left with 2 by 3 tan inverse infinity by 3. And this is equal to 2 by 3 into pi by 2. And this is equal to pi by 3. Hence our required answer is pi by 3. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.